Several years ago, he was asked to manage all of your pensions. Right now, they're saying that anyone who invested with Mr. Shaw has been defrauded. I'm Melissa Hernandez, and welcome to Ain't Yet Life. Today, I'm joined by the director of Tower Heist, Brett Radner. Welcome back to Miami. Thank you. And actor Michael Peña. How you doing? I'm doing awesome. Uh, I can speak Spanish, though, si. right? Yeah, can you speak a little bit? Come on. Como no, get living in Miami grand. a little bit. Get get to the there you go. <laughs> <laughs> no, you've got it down pat. Well, bienvenido a Miami. Gracias. So tell me a little bit about this movie, Tower Heist, directing it. There's yeah. a it's a little bit a melt, good melting pot. You yeah. grew up in Miami. There's a little bit of all the little worlds in there. Yes, so yes. do you use it as inspiration? Um, yeah, I mean I, I love making a movie that's ethnically diverse because it just it's you know, it's for I'm I'm trying to make a movie not just for you know, my friends, you know, and not just for the, this country, but for the world. So, you know, um, it's an international film, and there's, and there's people from all walks of life, and that's what makes great comedy, you know, where it comes from the character, where you put people from, that are completely different from different life experiences, and you put them all together. It makes for great fish-out-of-water comedy, and what's great is getting Eddie Murphy and Ben Siller and surrounding them with really, really talented, dramatic actors, and that's what Michael is. I got your ski hats. No, masks. I said ski masks. But the guy said these would keep us the warmest. He's an incredible dramatic actor, but he could also be funny. The rule was, I'm not gonna go get comedians. Normally in these types of movies, you surround the main actors with comedians, and then everyone's trying to just be funny. And, you know, they really put a lot of thought into their characters, and that was what, what made it work. A lot of thought into it. <laughs> yeah, no, I definitely, right? I definitely yeah. kept it serious, inside, and I yes. definitely... <laughs> The average apartment in the tower costs $5.6 million. We have the best views, most advanced security system, but you know what these people are really buying? White neighbors? Us, the staff, that pay for our full and undivided attention seven days a week. And Enrique, one other thing. I may have my own private island in Belize, but deep down, I'm just in a story of boy like Josh here. That's right, the S-104. Go Lions. No, but you know what? I remember when I was doing this movie, World Trade Center, I actually I met somebody that was like my character. <laughs> and it, it, it was like I went to uh, like this coffee shop, and literally, he, <coughs> I'm not gonna lie, the worst like customer service of all time. And he was like a little cheesy, but he loved himself yeah. so much. And you know, you'd have to wait for him to tell his joke. Like, and then I always come in like you know at the tail end of something. He's like, you know what? And then I said, I said, your mother. <laughs> like I was like, he, like every morning it was like that. And I was like, I got, I can't wait to do a, a movie where I could actually do it. And it was, I mean, it wasn't as big as that. I'm like, but you know, like. Just being in this movie with all these different crazy characters is amazing. I mean, Eddie Murphy just kills it in this movie. So it's not just Eddie Murphy, it's Ben Stiller, Tia Leone. There's so many. Everybody kills it. Yeah, there's so yeah. many great actors yeah. in this film. Precious. We have Precious. Yes, you do. <laughs> there you go. She, <laughs> she was amazing also. But what happened behind the scenes? Because getting all these people together, I'll there had to you, be something I, behind I'll the scenes. I'll tell you, but you can't tell anybody. Okay. Tell, yeah, don't tell, tell, tell anybody. I'm not going to tell anybody about it. Okay, we're going to tell you. At all. Okay? <laughs> In the scene when Eddie Murphy is, is, Gabby is showing Eddie Murphy how to open the safe, okay, Odessa, the character. Right. There was not any dialogue, and I told her off camera, flirt with Eddie Murphy. She was very nervous, and so she goes, really? I go, yes. She started flirting, the clothes started flying off. This is a PG-13 movie. We had to leave the set. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. It? We left. I get out of there. It yeah. got crazy. They were like going at it. But we didn't leave right away. Yeah, we watched. We stayed for we a little, 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 little bit. Just a little, just we a little peek. We peeked a little bit because it was And then we're like, we should probably leave because that's probably the right thing to do. It's time to go. Yeah. 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 Well, did you film any of it? YouTube? Oh, we filmed all of it. Oh, okay, there we go. YouTube. It's on the DVD. YouTube. It's on the expert. <laughs> I don't care what it takes, but we'll find a way to make things right. Yeah! people watch this film Michael well I mean I think it has something like I don't know I don't love all my movies and I love this movie I'm like I you know I actually saw it with like one other person and we were both laughing the entire time and it's like it it's 
it's got heart and it makes you feel good. You know, I'm like, I love the ending and I won't give it away. <laughs> but like, but it's you know, it's got great characters and it moves. I'm like, I didn't, I wasn't bored. You know, when I or there was no lull when I was watching the movie. And I'm like, that's more than what you could ask for. Right now, you're at, besides Tower Heist, you're yeah. going to be directing now the Oscars. Producing. Eddie, producing, I'm yeah, sorry. Okay. And Eddie Eddie Murphy actually yes. will be hosting. Yes, I asked him to host. Yeah. How amazing is that? Well, it, it was just coincidence, because when I was making Tower Heist, I never dreamed I'd be producing the Academy Awards. And I knew I had to get a great comedian, you know, because you need a comedian to really, you know, control that audience, you know. And it's a billion people, really, you know. So you need somebody who's quick and smart and charming and funny. And I was looking at Eddie and I said, if I were to ask you to do it, would you do it? And he said yes. And I was like, whoa. So Wonderful. I, I'm so confident going into it with Eddie Murphy as, uh, as the host. It's exciting. Well, three words why people should watch the movie. There you go. Action, comedy, and it's funny. And there you go. Action, comedy, Peña. Peña. Whoa. Oh, Peña. Yeah. Well, very proud of our Hispanic over there representing us very well in Hollywood. And yeah. of course, our Miami guy over yeah. there doing Half a great Cuban. job. Come Half on. Cuban, that's Represent. right. Represent the Cuban community. Thank you guys so much. Thank you. The meat's gone rogue. Come on and get it. You know this is a bad idea, right? That's it. I don't want you talking to me for the rest of the robbery. First thing you do, you gotta find the entry point. You gotta use your fingers when you find the entry point. You married? No, I ain't married. What's up? Come on and get it.